I will. I had to move a bunch of shit around. I do have a bunch of new stuff that I haven't reviewed. I don't know why I just don't do reviews. We're going to go right to the Dark Knight case, as you can see there. Alrighty, um, obviously it is the three main suits from, uh, the Christopher Nolan Batmans, um, you know, with the Dark Knight Rises coming, uh, next summer, we don't know if they're gonna change up the suit or not, we don't know, but, we'll get right in, um, I had these custom, uh, not custom, but, they're just like placemats, like, it looks like a wooden floor, it looks really good, it's like a, like a cherry color, I think it looks good with the Batman, uh, we have right here the DX, O2 Batman, um, you know, looking pissed off, I like the way he looks, um, you know, I got him posed with a sticky bum, sticky bum, huh, <laughs> a sticky bum gun, yeah, um, as the Hong Kong jump, as you can see, he's got his backpack on there, uh, very nice, um, that is my first night out Batman, as you can see, it is the Takara Batman. Um, I gotta clean him up a little bit. He's a little grimy. I bought the gauntlets off somebody off Sideshow Freak, so I haven't really cleaned him yet. He does have the Hot Toys head underneath. Um, uh, I did buy a different uh, ski mask from. I still need to fuck with it. It's not. I took it off a little while ago to take some pictures, but um, finally got this, guys. Uh, even though um, I got this about a week before. Um, Hot Toys announced uh, Toy Fair exclusives, uh, Batman Begins, Bruce Wayne. But, I do have the original costume now, and he is a fucking beast, and I love it. Yes, I will be getting the, the Bruce Wayne, uh, Batman Begins Toy Fair exclusive, just because I want to take that figure and display him like this. And then I will take the harness and shit off that figure and put it on him for... The Takara, and then I might do something where I will make it the uh, no mech survival suit before uh, he sprays it with the uh, paint and shit. Uh, I got a couple accessories on the back wall: Joker's uh, gun, a um, couple other things. Uh, I haven't updated the the wall of weapons, but um, I will eventually. As you can see, I still have some down here. Um, we'll go right over to the. Uh, the rest of my Dark Knight collection, as you guys can see here. Um, yeah, same thing. I got the uh, the cherry uh, floor going. Got Heath Ledger's Oscar trophy. Um, we have uh, the Joker and Gotham Police. Obviously, he's the uh, part of the DX01 Joker. There he is right there. Um, standard pose, you know. He, he doesn't, you don't see him that much in the movie to, to, to try to mock a different pose off him. Um, uh, we'll go right back there. This is my custom nurse Joker. Um, finally, again, I got him. Um, as you can see, he is fully custom. Um, he is on a Hot Toys Perseus muscle body. Therefore, he has uh, sculpted arms, as you can see there. Uh, maybe I can get in there. Yeah, you can see it in there. Sculpted arms. Uh, he has the Toysmon jacket, uh, uniform, whatever. And I did um, take the bank robber uh, Hot Toys head and I cut the neck off in order for it to fit on the Perseus uh, sculpted neck, which came out pretty good. Um, maybe I can get a zoom in. Um, King Grayskull from the Sideshow Freaks, he makes these socks, they're uh, movie accurate Joker socks, I got the clogs off eBay, as you can see, I mean, he has uh, sculpted legs, which is really, really fucking cool looking to have the Joker not have his, the, you know, all the joints on him showing. Um, obviously we have, uh, yeah, it's a custom shotgun, um, there's the uh, machine gun that came with the bank robber Joker, and here's my first ever Hot Toys figure, it's my DX-01 the Joker. Um, still one of my favorite figures of all time. Hot Toys has done. I mean, just, like, how could you not like this figure? I mean, look at the face. There's a lot of great custom sculpts out there. But, I mean, uh, you just, you can't fuck with the fucking, the DX head. It's just, it's spot on. My opinion. I mean, people, uh, other people might think not, but, um, 
Then I have another Joker back there. Um, he's pretty much just bashed together. Uh, he's got the bank robber head on him. Um, he looks menacing there, doesn't he? Fucking demented. Uh, he has the DC Direct, um, you know, vest on and pants. I, I didn't have extra stuff. I ended up selling one of them. Uh, obviously, here's the uh, bank robber Joker. You know, custom money that I made. Yes, Wayne's Butler. What's up, buddy? Um, I will be sending you some sheets of money and newspapers like I promised. Um, I just haven't got ink for my computer, I mean, for my printer yet. So those will be coming to you soon. Um, show you give me your address. Like I said, I, I made these $100 stacks. You know, I printed them all, cut them all out. It was kind of a pain in the ass. But um, here's my pose for the bank robber Joker. Um, it's pretty unique. and I haven't seen anybody pose him like this. And yes, like I said in other videos, he does have a watch on. Um, kind of just gives him that, you know, no, 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 I killed the bus driver. Um, I know he's not supposed to have his bag on at that point, but, all right, next shelf. Again, these are figures I have not done reviews on. I do have the Hot Toys 10th Anniversary, um, Batman, Demon, and Scarecrow combo. Got off my boy Kevin, uh, you guys know him on YouTube as Sadet. Uh, you might know him on Sideshow Freaks as Ritu. One, two, three, great, 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 yeah. Yes, yeah, uh, we made a trade for these. Um, he wasn't doing anything with them. But that's him. Uh, the Scarecrow is, you know, badass. If you guys seen any of Dean Knight's videos, he did some, uh, really, I mean, pretty much any figure that comes out, Dean Knight does a video on it, and it's spectacular. And it, if you guys want to get a good impression on how good the figures are, just watch his videos. Um, there's a, a custom uh, Bruce Wayne in the back, you know, he's just got the standard Hot Toys head, uh, cheap ass suit. And there, back there, hopefully I can get a good picture of him. This is actually Kevin's uh, Bruce Wayne here. Um, it's not mine. Um, ended up buying the figure off uh, a board member on Sideshow Freaks with the awesome suit. And this is... Uh, Adams, uh, I mask re I can't have never say his name on Sideshow Freaks. This is his custom head. Um, it's, it's fantastic. I mean, the likeness, it hasn't been painted yet, but the likeness of Christian Bale on there is unbelievable. Yeah, focus, focus. Come on! Okay, there it is. Uh, he's even got the scar and the mole, I mean, it, it's unbelievable. Uh, this is Batman Demon, another, uh, you know, like I said, great figure. Uh, in my opinion, I mean, it's not something that's like, oh my god, it's the Batman Demon figure. It, it, it's something to have if you're a Dark Knight fan, uh, Batman Begins fan, just to have in your collection. <coughs> Alright, uh, down here I'm missing a couple figures because I'm kind of working on one, but, uh, you know, there's Two-Face and Harvey Dent. Nothing really big to show about them. Uh, I have a custom ba uh, cop version Joker that I cut the neck off. That's also for my um, nurse Joker. Um, it looks, it doesn't look good right there, but it looks good. Uh, yeah, it looks good. And down here, I know it's on the bottom, but here's my uh, diorama. Wayne's Butler. See, I told you in a message last uh, week or this past week. That I made this just to fit in the Detolf, which is this display case. You know, it's about six feet tall. Um, table and chairs are from um, eBay, XS Studios. Awesome dude. Uh, he's also a Sideshow member. Um, high quality stuff. Uh, there's my Laughing Joker sculpt. Um, that's from Monkey Robot Master on the Sideshow Freaks. Um, Hot Toys version one uh, body. Uh, you know, I painted up the hands. The hands are all dirty and grimy and shit. I don't know if it'll focus, but... Then I have the, uh... TDK Batman back there. Um... You know, he's the, the one that they released before the DX. I like the figure, honestly. I, I like the way he's made. I personally, uh... I put him right up there with the DX as far as quality goes. And I like the head and neck better on it. But, uh, that's that little diorama put together with the broken window, the door, and shit like that. Alrighty. Um, 
I'll let you get a view of that cabinet from far. And like I said, I have all those in that cabinet. Very nice. And obviously we already went over this. Um, second shelf down is my Predator uh, sort of type diorama type shit. We have Hot Toys Predator 1 uh, with a custom uh, Tyler Durdom mask from Sideshow Freaks. He, he custom made this. It's ten times more accurate than the Sideshow mask as you can just see just by looking at it. Um, I recommend anybody who's got the Hot Toys Predator one to get this mask because it does make your Predator look ten times better. Then we have the uh, Wolf Predator from AVPR. Um, is the act the exclusive version with the uh, chest burster? You know, uh, pretty cool figure. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, let's see if we can get some fucking lights in here. And here's my um. Predators diorama. We have the uh, famous Mr. Black over here. I've yet to get the tracker. Predator. I will begin him as soon as he hits the U.S. Uh, I got a custom uh, spear type skull thing that I made for him. Because he, he is like the leader of the Super Predators. So I figured give him something a little different. You have over here a Falconer Predator. Badass figure in my opinion again. Uh, very simple poses. I got an extra Berserker head back there, and I have my painted Falconer head, that, which, uh, it's a Falconer head that I customized. I pulled the mask off, painted it all myself, um, took the mandibles from, uh, the Berserker extra head that I have, and, uh, that's what you got there. So that's all custom right there, guys. Um, next shelf... Uh, Michael Jackson Thriller Zombie and Michael Jackson Regular Thriller. Not much to say about that shelf. Rest in peace, MJ. <coughs> I'll shut that door. You guys, uh... Yeah, I apologize for not doing many videos, guys. Like I said, I just can only do so many videos. That's that case. Um, alright. Back it. Come on! This is my Terminators. Uh, we have the Terminator 1 Technor. A pretty standard pose. He's just uh, aiming the gun. Why does his hand look fucking retarded? Eh, I just found out that I'm retarded. Okay. Uh, police Station Arnold back there. Cyberdyne Arnold. Cyberdyne. Cyberdyne Systems Model T101. Let me have uh, that one. Yeah. What the feck? Hello. Alrighty. Um. Yeah, not much to say about the shell. Still have naked Arnold back there. Uh, T1000, T1000, blah, blah, blah. John Connor, T600. EX weathered skin, uh, T700 diorama, T700 blah blah blah. Much going on there. What I did get this motherfucker. Ah shit! No, it's not the Hot Toys tumbler. It is the Tyco tumbler. It's a good stand-in for it. Um, it looks badass. It's one six scale. It's in the 18 inch neck of the. Uh, uh, quarter scale Neca Predator up there. Yes, I did get him. And I also got the other ones in there. They're in the boxes. They're in the box. I'll get them hot. Oh! Neca Predators in the box. They're in the box because they're hot. They're hot because I get them hot. Oh! Sorry, that was a poor Christopher Walken. And...